Hey everyone, what is this big ugly box that's in the way of my blinds? Well, I'm gonna rant about it because honestly, it's pretty awesome. You might have seen it's a Verizon box. This is the Verizon 5G home internet setup. And I gotta say, it is amazing. And let me tell you why. Aside from it having to be mounted inside, it replaces both a modem and a router in itself. And the price for the services you get, you probably can't really beat if it's available in your area. So just wanted to share that real quick, how awesome Verizon's 5G home internet is. Just to take a quick look at it. Uh, Katie and I are so excited, aren't we, girl? Yeah, we're so excited. So we got this 5G home internet. We got the plus. So it starts for just 5G home at $25 a month if you're an existing Verizon user. If you have an account with Verizon already for a cell plan, then you can save like 50% on these things. Um, I have the home plus, which is $35 a month if you already don't use auto pay. Um, that helps knock off $10. Technically, I already have auto pay for my phone plan, so I'm paying $45 a month for it. But what does this get you, essentially? Well, let's go over to the exact plan information. So, 5G Home. So if you just want the regular one, the $25 a month one at the cheapest, you can get up to 300 megabytes download, 50 upload, which is pretty great for that price. Uses 5G and 4G. So you do have to check to make sure this is actually in your area and that you can actually uh, set this up. It's not available everywhere yet, but if it's available, I would highly recommend at least trying it. So my plus plan has 300 to 1000 megabits of download speeds and average of upload speed of 50. I have done testing for this for the past week just to verify that this is correct. And I'm also benefiting from the fact that my router, so they have to mount it somewhere that can get a good signal. When they come mount it, they move it around your house and then they kind of see where's a good place to put it and they can see where they have the best signal. Actually, behind my wall over there, you can't see it, but there is a, um, a tower across the street with two little white boxes on it. I'm not sure if you can see a little tower over there, but that is the actual 5G <laughs> um, antenna. So I have a direct line of sight to mine, so I get really good speeds here. Um, average in the past week, I've told, is between, um, actually what they say, between 300 and, well, around 800, 3 to 800 is what I've actually gotten. Um, when it's off peak hours, and more, the more people that use it, the, the slower they'll be, but I've had seen great service from this. Um, comparably, so you also get like, a free streaming device with it, Disney Bundle for 12 months, which is like ESPN Plus and uh, Disney and what's the other one, Hulu? Yeah. So that's pretty awesome as well, having the 5G ultra wideband with uh, the, it has a Wi-Fi 6 router. Um, so this thing actually, uh, this controls my whole house. And I used to have a mesh system and uh, I've, from what my, my tests have done, I've ran 4K video on all my devices, like an iPad Pro, my iPhone 13 Pro Max, my Apple TV Plus, my MacBook Pro, uh, all simultaneously, all at full resolution, and it took under like five seconds just for them to get off the ground in, in full res for uh, upsampling. So that's, that's mighty impressive. I've had streaming issues before getting the resolution up to where it needs to be with Cox, which is what I was going to compare to just now. I've had Cox before. I was on a business line, which was dedicated 100 megs, um, which I always got, and I wasn't too upset with that. But if you ever do residential, so you see all these pretty prices here, um, these have one-year term agreements, and then they go up by 20% usually. So if you see like any of these... Yeah, there's usually a 20% bump in um, around that, depending on what plan you're on, after the first year. With this Verizon Home Internet, depending on the plan you go on, they have a price lock for two years on that, three years on the plus, which is what I got, which is pretty nice. Um, also, no data caps. Verizon has no data caps in these plans. As you can see, they will cap out at 1.25 terabytes now because they used to be a terabyte, and I guess that was not enough for some people. 
Um, I was not too happy with their service, especially their customer support. Plus, I also don't have to have a modem anymore and a router because um, this Verizon thing takes the place of both. So yeah, it's big, it's bulky. They, the tech who installed it said they're coming with a smaller version that doesn't have to be suction cupped to the window. It can just be put placed anywhere. But for what I'm getting from it now, I could move this wherever I want. They're not allowed to install it outside, which was what I asked, um, which is unfortunate for now because it is in the way of the blinds, but I can just move it over there and just leave it that way. I could also move it somewhere else in my house where it's less noticeable, but this is direct line of sight and I wanted to get the really fast speeds to see how good that worked out. So overall, very happy with it, very satisfied. Highly recommend if it's available in your area, check it out. I'll try to put a link in the description. I'm not being paid by anyone to say this. I'm just super happy with it and partially happy with Verizon, partially frustrated with Cox, but this is uh, by and far I'm much happier than I expected to be when I made this decision. Oh, and another bonus, if you are locked in a contract with someone else, um, they will give you up to $500 towards credit, uh, termination fees in the sense of they will credit your account up to $500 with that. Um, I did not have to pay for any of the hardware. They came out and installed it themselves for free. I scheduled an appointment literally the next day. They had an appointment available and they came out to install it, which was awesome. Um, and then all the other stuff, but... Yeah, anyways, that's Verizon 5G home internet. Um, this isn't, this. I think this is like an extender or something. I don't know what that is, but I didn't get one. Um, I uh, highly recommend, and uh, feel free to check it out. Like and subscribe, check out my other videos, uh, or not, I don't care. Have a good day.